Hello, my name is Adolfo, and this is Life of Adolfo. I'm a diehard Mets fan, and the Mets just won. The series is 2-1 Mets over Phillies. One more win, and they advance. And on my thoughts, when I was thinking on the eighth inning when Francisco Alvarez was at bat, I was saying, you know what? It would have been better it was two outs, or he gets an out and let the next batter in. And the reason I was thinking of that is because for some reason, the Mets with two outs are all clutch. They proved it on this game. They proved it on the sixth inning with bases loaded, Sterling Marte at two RBIs. I believe there was no outs. Then two outs came around. I believe uh, Vientos was running, bases loaded. Sosa took him out at home plate. Then there was a pop-up that was two outs. And Marte came in clutch with two outs, like I mentioned. Two run RBIs. And on the following inning, the seventh inning, once again, two outs and Jose Iglesias gets two RBIs. On this inning, Francisco Alvarez got an out and that's already two outs. Francisco Lindor came in and once again, an RBI, RBI double. For three consecutive innings, two outs and the Mets managed to score five runs. The inning that I was a little bit afraid, everything that was happening, is when the Phillies scored, I believe that's when they scored the two runs. I believe it's the seventh inning. And Maytown walked players. I don't know why he wasn't trying to throw strikes. Stanley came in, he pitched. He allowed the RBI to Harper, but at the same time, he was throwing strikes. The Phillies did score two. I believe there was two players on base. If there was a home run, it would have been a 5-6 game at that time. There was a little bit of panic, a little bit of panic on my part, but the Mets managed to, to get out of that and then the following inning score. I also want to cover two things. One, one thing or two things that the broadcasters said, and the first one is that the Mets haven't allowed a run in the first five innings, only one run to Kyle Schroeder home run against Kenta. That points that our starting pitchers for the first five innings, one run in 15 innings. The second thing, because they were booing uh, Cody Clemens, I did not realize why they were booing. And they were booing because of the Roger Clemens, because he's the son of Roger Clemens, and the Piazza incidents. The bat, the thrown bat, and so on. It was a broken bat. Roger Clemens caught it. He didn't catch it. He picked it up and threw it back to Piazza. And with, in my view, an intention to hit him. And the last thing that I want to cover is three players. The first one is Jesse Winger. He did pop to the warning track, the first at bat, but you could see that he was hitting it on the barrel. Second at bat, home run. You could tell that he he's on point right now on that bat. The second player is Pete Alonso. Pete Alonso hit a home run, and he managed to walk two times discipline. And that's another player that was in a slump that is playing good. And the third player is Jose Iglesias. On the sixth inning, I believe so, two runners on base, the Phillies could just basically create more runs and Castellano hit it directly to him. And there was a double play that he did with Francisco Landor with Carl Schwarber running off base because he caught it and then he threw it in there. That was a key play. Again, bases loaded, he did get the two RBIs, and man, I wish that if he's a free agent, he is a free agent, he's going to get a contract. I wish that the Mets get him. I know we have Jeff McNeil. I know we have Acuna, but he makes pitchers. I wish that the Mets sign him because he knows how to work the count. He gets eight, eight, nine, ten pitches, and that works against the other pitcher. And he was clutch, and he's been clutch in the whole series. Not only the whole series, the whole year since he came up from a double A or triple A. And that's all I got. Three players that I noticed. Quintana. Quintana's ERA in the postseason, don't quote me. I'm, I'm not sure. In the last two games, is zero or maybe one run. I'm not sure. But with the Cardinals and the Mets, his ERA is way low as a starting pitcher. Hopefully we win this game, but I don't want to jinx it. I don't want to say 
what I think is going to happen because like I said, I don't want to jinx it. And that's all I got. Thank you. Thank you for watching.